don't know, are you sure that Tic Tac or or whatever that's called is 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 a great communication piece? That's what they do today? Okay, I'll I'll trust you. What's happening? Oh, we, we don't say that today. What's up, Nebraska Network? This is Leroy Wire, your Nebraska Network integrator. About a month ago, the function team sat down and we put together the vision that God has given our superintendent, Toby Schneckloff. And I am excited about it. We're going to be planning churches. We're going to be establishing more preaching points where people are going to get saved, delivered, and healed and discipled in the Lord Jesus Christ. So man, one of the key elements in that is ministers. And let me tell you, the Assemblies of God has some fine ministers who are spirit led and spirit filled. And a lot of those live right here in Nebraska. But a key element will also be emerging leaders. And we need a lot of emerging leaders if we're going to fulfill this plan and this goal that Superintendent Toby Schneckloth has. The word emerging excites me. And I looked it up and there are several meanings, but one of the meanings is coming into view. When my son, Caleb, who is an emerging leader, was in his first year at North Central University in Minneapolis, Michelle and I, we decided to go visit him. And as we got on the freeway in that busy traffic, we decided to use her navigational uh, e equipment on her vehicle, and that was for the first time. And let me tell you, we would see the screen and every time an, uh, an off-ramp came, we took that off-ramp, but the navigational system redirected us back onto the freeway. And after that happened three times, my other emerging leader, my daughter Mariah, who was sitting in the back seat said, Dad, it's not telling you to get off at every off-ramp, it's just telling you and showing you what's coming ahead. I wanna encourage you as a leader, as a minister, to pray to the Holy Spirit and ask Him to show you who the emerging leaders might be in your church or ministry. To show you how to invest in them. I am so glad that uh, over 20 years ago, my pastor and his wife saw me as an emerging leader and they invested in me. Pray to the Holy Spirit to show you the potential that's in them. Ask Him to see where their destination or their plan or purpose might be for their life and help to navigate and, and encourage them to go in that direction. I am also the administrative assistant and I help emerging leaders uh, obtain their credentials. I have been blessed to start some great friendships with these great young leaders and my life is richer because of it. Another definition for emerging is coming alongside. It's just like when you're driving down a freeway and another car is coming onto the freeway from the on-ramp and the courteous thing to do is move over into the left lane and allow that driver to come onto the freeway. In ministry, we need to move over and allow emerging leaders to minister right alongside of us. They need coaches and mentors and especially friends to help them to understand what ministry is all about. Another way that we can invest in emerging leaders is to invest in Vision Nebraska. And that's going to be the fund that's going to help us with church plants and merges and uh, ministry opportunities in the next coming years. Oh no, I hear the ending music. So, peace out. Oh, we don't say peace out anymore. Uh, what do we say? Work hard walk holy and worship him.